Okay, so today we're going to look at relationships between two vector equations of lines. And we're going to consider line 1 and line 2. Okay, so <laughs> the first thing you want to do is always look first at the direction. Right. And so if I look at my direction, that's this one here and this one here. And you want to ask yourself, could these lines be parallel or the same line? Well, if I have negative 2, 1, negative 1, and if I look at the other one, negative 4, 2, negative 2, if I multiply this by negative by positive 2, I get this. So it's a scalar. All right, a scalar multiple of each other. So because it's a scalar multiple, that means we could have parallel or the same line. All right, parallel or same line. So now, in order to find that, if they are parallel, that means all the points, there's no point on this line that is on this line. They are completely different. If they are the same line, that means every single point on this line is also on this line. And vice versa. Yeah, and vice versa. So to, to do it, how are we going to find out? Well, let's just way? test one of those points. So I want to test 3, 4, 6. Okay. And I want to know, does that point lie on line 2. Okay, so if we plug it in here, so I get 3, 4, 6 equal to 5 minus 2, 7. We end up with... La la la. la, la. <laughs> okay. So now we just want to find their value for a. Let's just look at our x coordinates here. So 3 is equal to 5 minus 4a. So subtract the 5, I get negative 2 is negative 4a, and so a is 1 half. Well, now check the next coordinate. Let's check our y. Okay, so I get 4 equals negative 2 plus 2a. Bring the 2 over, at 6 is 2a, and so now I have 3 is equal to a. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We have an a of 3, a of a half. So what does that mean? That means that this point is not, so 3, 4, 6 is not on line 2. So if that point is not on line 2, then they can't be the same line. They're not. They have to be parallel. None of the points on this point is, are on this line. So those two lines are parallel. Great.